How's it going guys? Welcome back to my channel and to another movie reaction. Today we're gonna be watching The Exorcist, which is a Patreon request from our Patreon Six String. Yes, it's finally happening. Thanks to you, Six String. Thank you so much for requesting The Exorcist and sponsoring this reaction. You won't believe how happy I am today, guys, because I'm finally watching The Exorcist and I still can't believe it because it's been on my list since I've started movie reactions it's like more than a year ago and i'm really not getting the chance to watch it because of the priorities you know and then there's this period of time when i didn't record anything i didn't watch anything and then there's this like catching up with the patreon requests so that's why like everything is getting in the way of watching the exorcist and also the shining i'm planning to do that but i don't know when so by now you already know me guys i'm a huge fan of horror movies but there's something you don't know is that i'm like from the horror genre the demonic possessions the exorcism all of this stuff is my favorite because they scare me the most not all of them like there are some low budget ones which i enjoy but i laugh uh, <laughs> i laugh when i watch them but there's this like high budget movies also not all of them but some of them really terrify me and i've never shared with you which horror movie is my favorite and it is I don't know if you guys know it, it's The Exorcism of Emily Rose. From the moment I saw it, like I started getting nightmares. Every time I'm alone in like a dark room or something, I get really scared and I start hearing some like weird sounds around me. It's all because of that movie. So The Exorcist is a classic one and it was released in the year 1973. Honestly, I've heard about The Exorcist a lot and that it's like the god of horror or something like that but like as i've said i didn't get the chance to see it before and also because like when i watch uh, horror movies without the reaction like when i watch them alone or when i used to watch them like uh, i don't watch them alone i watch them with my family especially my mom because she like introduced me to horror i've said it before in my alien reaction so yeah because my mother always want to see like new movies she doesn't want to like see the classic ones she's convinced that they are not scary so that's why every time i suggest we watch the exorcist she's like no 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 i'm not gonna watch from the 70s no so that's why i didn't watch it until this day of course i know nothing about the exorcist except that it is about uh, demonic possession for sure because of the title it is called the exorcist maybe a priest will like perform some exorcism is gonna be the main uh, character the protagonist in the movie i don't know i have no idea and i didn't read the story at all so now we're gonna go fully blind with it and yep enough with the intro because i'm so excited let me close this page so before we start guys let me remind you to hit the like if you enjoy this video and subscribe if you're new to the channel and want to see more horrorish reactions from me and if you're interested in the early uncut reactions and also the movie requests make sure to check out my patreon the link is down below and i really hope you guys request a lot of horror movies movies like infinity amount of horror movies i do them with a lot of double passion like <laughs> i don't know how to describe it but i get very happy when i'm about to watch a horror movie i don't know why i really like to scare myself and torture myself anyway let's start watching the exorcist it's happening <laughs> oh <laughs> happening i still can't believe it i feel like this is a dream i really hope it doesn't disappoint me oh imagine like oh imagine no 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 i don't think so the exorcist maybe this is in egypt the demonic possessions are always in egypt <laughs> near the pyramids you know what i'm saying iraq oh okay is this an archaeologist no no something will <laughs> okay better than getting your hands in there a statue demon creepy what's it doing in iraq <laughs> how did it get there he's scared or maybe that's just his hypertension medicine what's going on with them They didn't mention what year was it? Was it in 1973? Maybe before that, I don't know. 
Pay attention, please. Something wrong with them. <gasps> oh, he want to check out something here. That statue is the devil, isn't it? Dogs? So creepy. Creepy? Is he back? Someone got in from the window. Carl, oh, we've got rats in the attic. You better get some crap. Rats? That's horrible. I think it's clean. All right, then we've got clean rats. Clean rats. <laughs> Maybe plum. Or maybe rats. Now you just get the traps. He's telling you there's no rats. All right, hustle background and action. She's an actress. That's a priest. I know this song. It's too popular. I used to have this app for ringtones a few years ago. And there was this one and named The Exorcist. That's why I know it. She's so elegant. Boys, I've talked to them all. No, don't get involved. Yeah, walk away. That's better. Do to death. Oh, mom, can't we get a horse? No. They are a very happy mother and daughter. I wonder what's gonna happen to them. <laughs> Something bad will happen. But if she just kept walking away from everything and not getting involved, nothing will happen. Father. What's wrong with this, father? I'm a Catholic. <laughs> yeah, you too, father. Walk away. Never get involved. He was a boxer? Mom, I could take you somewhere where you'd be safe. You wouldn't be alone. This is my house, and I'm not going no place. There. She's cute. Hey, where'd this come from? <gasps> Closet. How? Who put it there? Yep. You know how. No. Why did you do that? It always starts with this damn board. <laughs> Let's both play. Why? You really don't want me to play, huh? Captain Howdy said no. Captain Howdy? Captain Howdy. Howdy? Captain Howdy. Do you think my mom's pretty? Imagine him say no. That isn't very nice. <laughs> he didn't answer. He doesn't trust the mom. She's cute. Oh. Father is drinking. Shame. <laughs> He shouldn't be drinking, right? This guy is the father too. I could see about a transfer, Damien. Damien. I need reassignment, Tom. I want out of this job. It's wrong. It's no good. It's more than psychiatry, and you know that, Tom. Some of their problems come down to faith, their vocation, the meaning of their lives, and I can't cut it anymore. True. So he's already an exorcist. This one too. I think I've lost my faith, Tom. Mm. He lost his faith. He should leave the job. Can you believe this? He doesn't even call his daughter on her birthday for Christ's sake. Oh, so he's living. I thought he passed away. The daughter's father, I mean. <laughs> Not the father of the church. Operator, she heard. What are you doing here? My bed was shaking. <gasps> No, Captain Howdy, it's him. It's not the rats. No, are you gonna check it? No, <gasps> she's not scared that a rat might jump on her face or maybe on something else. <laughs> now this is creepy. I'm gonna hire the volume just for fun. Guys, if I screamed, please watch out for your ears. Oh no, oh no, no. Should have waited till morning. <gasps> oh, that was you? Okay, don't scare me like like that. <laughs> there are no rats here, see? Now go back down. She's making a huge mistake. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Fers. <laughs> you see, no rats. Thanks a lot. That's terrific. <laughs> you know, I should keep Shinobi in my hands. I can hide like this. Now what? <gasps> what? <gasps> what? Did you see that? That's why I hate statues. They're creepy. What are you doing? What's wrong? Read normally. <gasps> Girl! Tell me if you feel a vibration. I don't feel anything. And the red light goes on. That's your temperature. I don't want it. Mm. 
She changed! What's up with you? How did this happen? A disorder of the nerves. At least we think it is. We don't know yet exactly how it works. Oh. 10 milligrams a day. It's a stimulant. My God, she's higher in the kite now. It will make her worse. My daughter isn't depressed. Maybe she is. Take her to a shrink. Do you think I should take her to a psychiatrist? Definitely. We should wait and see what happens with the Ritalin. No, 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 no. Waiting is the biggest mistake. I don't her. understand. She doesn't swear. She let loose quite a string while I was examining her. What'd she say? She advised me to keep my fingers away from her. Goddamn cunt. <laughs> You're laughing? You don't think a psychiatrist? We'll wait and see. No, you shouldn't wait. Try not to worry. How? Yeah, how? She don't let my doctor come near her. You should have called me the minute it happened. His mother? If you wasn't a pretty big famous psychiatrist now, Park Avenue. He should have been a psychiatrist. Mama, it's Demi, Mama. Poor mother. Why you did the bitch to me, Demi? Oh. Be I'm gonna take you home. Be it. I feel sorry for him. He doesn't look okay at all. There seems to be an alien pubic hair in my gym. Alien. <laughs> Over behind the church. Who's the priest I keep seeing there? He's there all the time. Damien Karras. He's our, our psychiatric counselor. His mother passed away. She passed away. You see, Ben? <gasps> Creepy girl. She's still cute. Oh, 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 oh. <gasps> I think we've got a guest. You're gonna die up there. <gasps> what? Reagan? I'm sorry, she's been sick. She okay. didn't know what she was saying. What's wrong with me? It's nerves, and that's all. Take your pills and you'll be fine, really. The pills will make her worse. A lot worse. She should take her to a psychiatrist immediately. Like tomorrow morning. I think the guests left. <gasps> Reagan? <laughs> Oh my gosh! <laughs> Only the bed is shaking! Now she believes her! <laughs> that was creepy. Shut up and go to sleep. Good night. <gasps> creepy nightmare. <gasps> That dream was so creepy. I felt the chills. <gasps> Fucking bastard! Girl is going mad. So? Shaking in the bed. That's doubtless due to muscular spasms. The whole bed was thumping and rising off the floor and shaking. It's her brain. You're not getting it, idiot doctor. What causes this lesion in the temporal lobe? He's just guessing. <laughs> Poor girl. Regan, can you sit up? She doesn't deserve this. She was a sweet, cute girl. A happy one also. She was so happy. Her smile was beautiful. This is not fair. It's all because of that freaking board she played with. How can she watch this? It's her daughter. Oh, it's hard to watch this. Oh, it's going well so far. Oh. Something will happen. Oh, so nothing happened. There's nothing there. You want me to run another series? You were wrong. Chris McNeil's on the phone. She says it's urgent. Things have gotten worse since I found you. I think you're home upstairs. What's happening? I'm violent. Oh my god! She's going through a lot. <laughs> Poor girl. Is it negative? In other words, normal. Everything's normal. I think it's time we started looking for a psychiatrist. It's finally time? Gosh, should have done that from the start. <laughs> What's happening here? Why is the police? 
Here we go. <gasps> Did you see that? I swear I saw it. <gasps> she ran away. Oh no, there she is. What's Burke got to do with it? There wasn't anybody here, so when I went to get the Thorazine, I had him stay with her and we have to start looking for a shrink. Suppose he heard. What's up? Burke's dead. <gasps> He must have been drunk. He fell down from the top of the steps right outside. The girl killed him, or the demon inside the girl. Captain Howdy? Yeah, it is. If he talks to me, I think he'll leave you. I'm speaking to the person inside of Reagan now. Answer me now. <gasps> oh my god! Who are you? <gasps> oh my god! Let's <laughs> go! to get scared i don't know why oh, what's happening to me i should chill walk away don't get involved damn it what do you want leave him alone you look like a boxer he is a boxer william f kinderman homicide homicide well you know this director was doing the film here burke dennings you're also familiar how last week he died. You read how he died. But was found at the bottom of those steps with his head turned completely around, facing backwards. No way! Didn't happen in the fall? It's possible. Possible? However, unlikely. But it is possible. Answer the question, Father Paranoia. <laughs> Father Paranoia. It fits him. We call it uh, some nambuliform possession. It starts with a um, conflict or a guilt, and it leads to the patient's delusions that his body has been invaded by some alien intelligence. I'm not going to lock her up in some goddamn asylum. There's a whole team studying her case. 88 doctors! 88 doctors? Well, you know, he is right. Do you have any religious beliefs? No. What about your daughter? No. Have you ever heard of exorcism? A doctor would never suggest that. The victim's belief in possession is what helped cause it. So in that same way, the belief in the power of exorcism can make it disappear. He got a point. You're telling me that I should take my daughter to a witch doctor. Witch doctor. <laughs> but her daughter never had this thought, you know. They're not religious. Maybe she heard it at school, in a movie or something. And without her knowing, it got into her head. That's the only explanation. As much as I love this genre, I stopped believing in it, you know, in real life, I mean. There's no possessions, it's all in here. <laughs> but you know, in the past, I used to believe it might happen. But not anymore, like with this science, no. But you know, a doctor would never suggest this thing. Or maybe, yeah, he got a point, like, she might think it's working and like, get it out of her head. It might work. <gasps> No! Where did you get that from? They're not religious, remember? Did you put this in Reagan's bedroom? It might be Carl. Not me. I didn't. He didn't? Then who was it? Of course I didn't. She didn't. I didn't put it. Who did? Might your daughter remember Mr. Dennings was in her room that night? She was heavily sedated. Why are you asking all this? It's strange. The deceased comes to visit, stays only 20 minutes, leaves all alone, a very sick girl. It is very strange. Now, my hunch, he was killed by a very powerful man, point one, and the fracturing of his skull, point two, plus the various other things we mentioned, can make it very probable Okay. that the deceased was killed and then pushed from your daughter's window. What? Would you like some more coffee? Please. He's not leaving. Or maybe her coffee is really tasty. You're a very nice lady. She is very nice. Doesn't deserve all of this. Oh, she knows it's her daughter. She's terrified. Good thing the daughter didn't come down and embarrass her with some move. Now what's happening? 
Finally meeting him. <sighs> that scene was short but very intense. She stabbed herself down there. Is she alright? How do you go about getting an exorcism? I beg your pardon? Somebody very close to me is probably possessed. It needs an exorcism. Since my little girl. Poor mother. I could see her as a psychiatrist, but I can't oh, see her. Oh, not a psychiatrist. She needs a priest. Can't you help her? Just help her. <laughs> oh, I feel so sorry for her. So Reagan is always like that. She's never back to normal. It's progressing fast. Oh god, I'm not prepared. I'm not prepared. <gasps> it's gotten worse. Hello, Reagan. Oh my god. Reagan! She's not cute anymore. I'm not Reagan. I'm Damien Carroll. And I'm the devil. The devil himself. Your mother sit here with his curse. Would you like to leave a message? I see that she gets it. Creepy. The voice is so creepy. Then you must know my mother's maiden name. He knows. What is it? <laughs> <laughs> oh my... <laughs> Disgusting! <laughs> Why green? <laughs> what was that? Ew. Why green? It should be black or red. Something wrong with the drawings? Nothing wrong, right? I'm only against the possibility of doing your daughter more harm than good. Nothing you can do could make it any worse. Yeah, exactly. Can't do it. Oh, come on. The church would accept his signs of possession. Like what? Like her speaking in a language she's never known or studied. I have to look it up. I thought you were supposed to be an expert. Yeah. There are no experts. Really? What I think is best for your daughter. Six months under observation in the best hospital you can find. I'm with him. Now I want you to tell me that you know for a fact that there's nothing wrong with my daughter except in her mind. Yeah, how can she throw up green liquid? Did Reagan know a priest was coming over? No. Did you know my mother died recently? Is Reagan aware of it? No. Not at all. It's not important. Good night. It is important. He's not helping. So this is not just a demonic possession. It's the devil. Like a devil possession? Devilish possession. What an excellent day for an exorcism. You'd like that? He'll do it. The green stuff is still on her. No one cleans it. The devils just want to play. He's bored. He probably did too, don't you agree? You speak Latin. I got to absolve. That's the first sign. La plume de matant. <laughs> the devil is having fun. And lies stinking in the earth. Why? What did she do to you? What's that? Holy water. You keep it away. It burns! I hope Reagan is not feeling pain. Who are you? No one! Creepy voice! <laughs> oh my god, poor Reagan. What do you think? I think now he's convinced that it is a possession. I told Reagan that was holy water. I sprinkled it on her and she reacted very violently. It's tap water. <gasps> it's not holy. So she's not possessed? She yeah, tell him. She pushed him out her window. That was <laughs> Creepy. It's English. How do you know? It's English in reverse. Huh? Give us time! That is done! No one! I have no one! There's more than one inside her, I think. Marin? Yeah, I'll be right there. What's going on? <laughs> I'm scared. I'm really scared. I'm feeling the chills. <sighs> the atmosphere is scary, you know what I'm saying? No background music. It's dark. What's happening? What's happening? <laughs> what is it? <laughs> Help me. <gasps> the 
that's Reagan? Or what? Well, she wrote this? Like, not wrote, but she did this? He'll sure help her now. You want to do the exorcism yourself? Yes. Are you experienced? Might be best to have a man of experience. Yeah. In the meantime, I'll call you as soon as I go. Please hurry, there's no time. What about the exorcist? Have you any ideas? How about Lancaster Marin? Marin. Well, I had notion he was over in Iraq. He's finished. Came back three or four months ago. The guy from the beginning of the movie. He's had experience. I didn't know that. Ten, twelve years ago, I think, in Africa. Good thing he's in town. He's got the invitation. It's like the devil calling him. He did say Marin a lot of times in the recording. I think from now on the movie will get extra intense. Why the fuck? This is creepy. Look at those eyes, so creepy. I'm Father Marin. Father Marin is here. Father Karras, it's an honor to meet you, Father. Oh my God! He's preparing. This is creepy. Oh God. <laughs> wow, I've never seen a huge match in a matchbox before. Really cool. Especially important is the warning to avoid conversations with the demon. We may ask what is relevant. Anything beyond that is dangerous. Okay. The demon is a liar. He okay. will like to confuse us. Okay, got it. I'll keep those in mind in case I met the devil one day. <laughs> Do not listen. Do not listen. Some background on the different personalities Reagan has manifest. So far I'd say there seem to be three. Three, I knew it. There's only one. Only one? So he's confusing you. Ooh. <gasps> Can you hear that? Can you hear that? No, 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 don't get in, don't get into the room. No, 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 no. What is your daughter's middle name, Mrs. McNeil? Teresa. Teresa. What a lovely name. This will be hard on the mother. She should go away for a while and then come back. <sighs> Holy water. Stick your cock up her ass, you motherfucking <laughs> work. Be silent! <laughs> He's very expert. You can tell from the way he's doing it. <laughs> Ew! <laughs> What's he doing? Proud men have risen up against me. Me, my God. I think this father got his faith back after this. Your mother sucks cocks in hell, oh, Lord, Paris, you prayer. faithless oh, slime. Come on. Almighty Father, <gasps> call for help to redeem through your son. I hope she's gonna be all right after this. She might die. And you wanted to do this alone, Father Karras. The response, please, Damien. Damien, what's up? Serpents and scorpions, grant me the true face of the devil to confront this cruel demon. Her tongue. <laughs> God, so creepy. See the cross of the Lord. Because she's throwing up. <gasps> Wash your hand. That's the devil. It's out? No, it's not out. It's not out. <laughs> it's no use so far. <laughs> Father? I cast you out! Now he's angry. Heights of heaven to the depths of hell! Fuck him! Who lives and reigns with the Father! Stop! Stop! <gasps> Defender of the human rights! You killed your mother! You left her alone! Damien, don't respond! Judge of the living and the dead! Oh no! Oh no! It's the power of Christ that compels you! That the power of Christ compels you! The power, the power of, Christ of Christ compels you! Compels you. <laughs> I think it's working, but please don't kill the girl. He so? brought you low by his bloodstained crest. <laughs> it didn't work! <laughs> What's happening? The statue. He's exhausted and got his faith back for sure. Start again. Damien is even more miserable now. He was already suffering in his life. Why is girl? Doesn't make sense. Yeah, it's all because of the Ouija board. I think the point is to make us despair, to see ourselves as animal and ugly, to reject the possibility that God could love us. You're just guessing. You don't know the answer. This poor girl doesn't deserve this. Where did her mother go? 
Yeah, take your hypertension medicine in time. The devil is going personal with Damien. Leave his mother alone. Dimi, why you do this to me? What the f You're not my mother. Dimi, please. Her same voice. What is it? Her heart. Can you give her something? She's going to come. You're not my please. mother! Damien, get out. Can you do it alone without Damien's help? He got plenty of holy water. Here we go again! The devil is kinda tired. No energy to fight back. <laughs> is it over? No. Is she gonna die? She might. That's what I'm scared of. No. How do you know? She might die. Emily Rose died. You know, it's a true story. I think she died in the exorcism session. That's what I remember. <gasps> it's you! <gasps> No! Father! <gasps> He's dead. You bastard! You son of a bitch! <laughs> Come into me! Okay. The devil killed both of them. Do you want to make a confession? He's alive. Are you sorry for having a friend of God? I always send you your past life. So that was his punishment? This is not fair. I can't believe this. They're both dead. I wasn't expecting this. Storage. Yeah, move back, please. I found this in your room. Keep it. Don't take it. Come on, honey. We have to get going. She shouldn't take anything with her. Sell everything in the house and get out. What's up? I want to see Regan. Where is she? She doesn't remember any of it. Okay. She's okay. This is Father Dyer. Hi, Father. Hello. She's back to being sweet again. <gasps> so she's okay? I thought you'd like to keep this. Yeah, please don't take it with you. Why don't you keep it? No! Huge mistake! Lieutenant? How's the girl? She seemed fine. That's important. Yeah. That's important. Very important. Back to business. Back to work. Bye, Father. Goodbye. Father Dyer, you go to films? I got passes. Cool. So, Reagan is really okay? Oh, <laughs> what a creepy ending! <sighs> it was so intense! God! Honestly, like, I wasn't expecting this level of intense, like, this level. I was expecting, like, this level. I don't know how to describe how I feel right now. Like, I'm feeling really good because this is a very good horror movie. Was this, like, the first exorcism movie? Like, maybe it was the first. Like, I cannot imagine how people would feel back in the 70s, 73, right? Wow, like, imagine seeing this back then. I'm sure, like, people were terrified when they saw it man i wish i saw it back then like would have been like an epic experience but i finally did it i finally watched this movie my favorite scene would definitely be i have two favorite scenes the first one which is my most favorite one was when uh reagan when she like suddenly like was going downstairs backwards like and then she like got blood out of her mouth this was terrifying this was the first scene that terrifies me the other favorite one when she threw up green stuff on damien <laughs> it was so sudden so scary and then it was kind of funny this was amazing and also the cast the actors all of them they were really amazing and brilliant i give this movie 10 out of 10 super awesome one of the scariest movies ever i really loved it i really hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to the exorcist and if you did, don't forget to leave a like, check out the links in the description, and I'll catch you next time. Bye!